I only fly first class and I only buy coach tickets. That's right, I get the big seats, the perks, the food, priority everything for my bags, and I pay the same price as you. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to do it just like me. Okay, listen, so there's no secret or no trick to any of this. All I know is that somebody explained it to me, so I'm gonna explain it to you guys. All right, the first rule to flying like a boss is non-negotiable. You have to fly a lot. And it, the truth is, if you don't wanna fly a lot, you might as well stop watching because you're, you're always gonna be in the back if you don't wanna try and do this. Now, so really, all this is, is we're taking advantage of the airline loyalty programs and what they have to offer, the perks and benefits that they have to offer. So all this is kind of like dating. Well, she wants you to commit, right? What well, the airlines do too. So the second thing is you have to commit. You have to commit to one airline or another, and that's what's going to get you what you need to get. So me, I committed to American Airlines, and they actually have three status levels that you can achieve. Well, now, actually, I think that it's four. Of course, they decided to make it more difficult to get these statuses because everybody wants to get them now. Okay, so commitment equals loyalty equals status. And what that status is gonna get you is all those seats that you see, all the food, all the, all the baggage, everything that you need comes from status from the airlines. Okay, so that's going to be our number three. And status is, like I said, that's what you're looking for. That's how you're going to get all the perks and benefits. Okay, so let's talk about these statuses for a while. The first status, gold, well, like I said before, you're going to have to fly no matter what to get these and gold is gonna be your first stop. To get gold, you have to fly 15,000 miles. And just so you know, 15,000 miles is a lot. So if you wanna take a control, let's say going from New York to LA, that's about 5,000 miles, give or take. So you're gonna be taking that trip multiple times just to, just to get the very first tier of gold in American Airlines. The second tier is platinum, and you're gonna need 30,000 miles. And you can see where this is going. So even for these two statuses, you're not really gonna get much. You get a little something, uh, maybe an upgrade here and there, but trust me when I tell you, it's not really that much big of a deal. So now when you get to the higher tiers, the top two tiers, platinum pro, which is gonna get you a lot more, you have to earn 45,000 miles and then executive is the very very top one you have to earn 60,000 miles and believe it or not in 2021 that 60,000 miles is going to go to a hundred thousand miles so all they're doing they're just making it tougher to get these perks and benefits but when you get there you're gonna love it all right so now getting these statuses it's not easy trust me these aren't frequent flyer miles that you could just buy and then jump a status or anything like that. The only way you can get these, these statuses is through elite qualifying miles. And what that means is, well, let me just cut to the chase. The only way you can buy these things, the only way you can get these miles is through time in the air. That's it. You literally just have to fly, which now we go back to reason one. You have to fly a lot. Okay, so I currently have the Platinum Pro status, and that's what affords me to get all of my upgrades, complimentary free upgrades, all the time. I get first class everywhere, and it's amazing. Okay, the last step in this process is the most punishing, and you're going to hate it, but you'll understand when you get there. 
you must keep earning these 45,000 miles, 60,000 miles, whatever status level you achieve every single year. So at the end of the year, your balance goes back to zero and you have to start all over again and you must reach them, well, as they say, within 12 months to get to whatever status that you want. I know, I know it's gonna cost a lot of money, it's a lot of time, but in the event that you get there, it's gonna be worth it. You're gonna get membership to the coolest club in the sky. You get to sit in the front, you get to get all the perks, all the free food, all the free liquor that you want. You're gonna love it. You just gotta sacrifice to get it, like anything else in this world. I did it, other people have done it. It's attainable, you just gotta get there. So that's it, that's the process. You just have to keep repeating it. And I know it's not easy, but nothing in the world is. They're literally giving you the keys to the kingdom. All you have to do is just go out and get it. So just to let you know, that's how I do it. That's how everybody else does, does it. And if you didn't know, now you know. I mean, of course, none of this matters if you have a private jet. <laughs> That's one of my goals in life. Anyway, thanks for watching. This is Tony versus the World.